Greetings, my fellow detectives, and welcome back to the sinking city of Oakmont. First of all, guys, hope you're doing good, hope you're doing great, hope you're doing amazing, hope you're excited for these new adventures or mysteries that are going to present itself, and which we are going to solve. I thought we could start off by just going to the boat, and maybe go to the hotel. Because uh, we're kind of jumped into the action straight away, without... You know, without uh, dropping off our stuff, we're kind of probably tired from the trip. Not that he can sleep that much, as he said. He doesn't even sleep. Um, where do we go up? Uh -huh. This is the way out of the docks? This is not the way out of the docks. How do we go there? Is Aha! Uh -huh. The gate! Yeah, the gate in front of the bar is probably one of the way out. So let us go through there. Who are you? Have I seen you before? I haven't seen you before. Hmm. And the rain does not stop at all. Okay, so it uh, the surroundings move hey, a little knock bit. It off. Oh, sorry. You want to talk? No. But that guy is still praying, though. Okay. Let us not. Uh, Sidetrack too much and let's go straight to the boat. Uh, that's not through here. Probably just straight away. We have solved everything to be solved around here. Although we have not discovered uh, this part of the docks yet. Oh, we will come back eventually. Aha, uh -huh, but the way is blocked. But it... Maybe I understand it now. Maybe. Maybe it was like a real flood and everything was underwater. Oh, there's no guards here. Because I initially thought, how come that all these buildings are so broken like the war happened? But it's because the flood probably just dragged everything to here. Whoa. No photograph. You hear me? I did it. Uh huh. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Anyways, it seems to be I'm almost sidetracking. Okay, let's quickly just go see what's the around at these docks. Oh shit! Oh my god. What are you doing? Why are you creeping around here? Oh, what have you been doing? Suspicious. Suspicious. You're all very suspicious. How do you get a guard through here? Does the car fit through this? Weird. Weird. Hmm. A boat. A very rusty boat. Anything to see in the distance? Some mountains? A lighthouse. I haven't seen that yet. We cannot go inside. We cannot. Okay. Nothing to see here. Uh, how do we get out? There we go. Okay, enough side tracking. The doors open automatically, by the way. Nope, not every. No photograph, you hear me? Why don't you want to be photographed? But guys, you look so damn suspicious, man. Well, seems like everybody hates us. Okay. Grim Haven Bay. There we go. I do wonder where all the guards went. These dreams are so vivid. It's insane. Lost at sea. 
Robert Throckmorton funded an expedition to discover the origin of the mass hysteria gripping Oakmont. The expedition was to explore the seabed near Oakmont. Contact with the expedition was soon lost. Albert Throckmorton was the only known survivor, though he was subsequently murdered. I was hard to find any other expedition members dead or alive. Throckmorton will be waiting for my report in his manor in Southern Old Grove. Nice. Those are my Crew buddies. Of the Cyclops. Semper Fortis, brothers. Okay. Nothing at the back. Nothing at the back. Crew of the Cyclops. Crew of the Cyclops. Semper Fortis, brothers. Crew of the Cyclops. What is this? My diary, part one. I don't know what exactly sank the USS Cyclops. Only remember the screams and the metal creaking, water filling the deck, and my headache. The worst I've ever had. I found myself among the floating seaweed, drowning. A nearby piece of a boat helped me survive and reach the shore of a small island. They found me on it later, starving, half mad, and babbling about an ancient rune and their de denizens, de denizens. The officials said none of what I thought had seen was real, but my memories are true. My strange powers gained after that ordeal, prove it. I found something horrible on an island, something old and dark and slithering, and it still haunts me. Interesting. Very much interesting. Let's have a quick look at everything here. It is a very... Yeah, if this is the Devil's Hotel, it definitely holds up to his name. Can I rotate it differently? Charles Never W. Never again, they say. Ah, that's his army tag, probably. A painting of shipwrecks. Okay, that's that's in theme. <gasps> nice. Oh yes, gangster, king's robes. Uh, they were man of science, fisherman, police envoy, plague doctor, master sleuth, cultist. <laughs> it's got a squid on his head. Vinci Vanka. Oh, I do like the wind coat, but the day wear is nice as well. Newcomer. Wind coat. I'm gonna go with the wind coat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, maybe it's too soon for a wind coat. Let's stay as newcomer. You know, we can use our backpack and our supplies. Let's stay as a newcomer for now. That's a wonderful, amazing, and beautiful uh, bathroom. Yeah, it's nothing creepy about it. Raids on Innsmouthers. The number of attacks on the Innsmouth immigrants has increased. Raids are intensifying, with more and more Innsmouthers exposed to abuse and assault. Sometimes whole families are found dead in their houses. Police are on the case, with several illegal insmother businesses captured and their owners sent to jail. The city ought to have been cleaned of this fish-faced scum long ago, said Robert Throgmorton, head of the Throgmorton Grand family. I regret only one thing, it all started too late. Had we not neglected our civic duties, my son Albert would still be here with us. Okay, did we? Aha, uh -huh, we got a letter. Note from Johann Johannes Vandenberg. Mr. Reed, it seems that you overexerted yourself while conducting the investigation for Mr. Throgmorton. Forgive me for my audacity, but I have brought you to the Devil's Reef while you were unconscious. Please take care of yourself in the future. I won't be there for you every time. Yours truly, Johannes. Have we gained that to our mind palace? No, we did not. We still got the key to the headquarters. Got some lore. And some documents, my diary, and the notes. Those are all the things we've got. Oh, Makes we've... this place feel more like home. I miss Boston already. Yeah, it's constantly, constantly raining here. Can we open other doors? No. We need a little bit of light. We probably can use some. 
let's see. Oh, we can open a little bit. Nothing. Okay, seems like nothing. The Nightmare, someone's diary. Let's just read it. I boarded up the window and locked the doors. They're just men. The Yellow King's gang. They can't get here now. Now there's only me. Me and these nightmares. A little longer and I'll figure them out. So, King's gang is definitely Dr. Johannes' his gang. But, oh my Christ! Jesus, what did he draw here? Why would you? Oh, oh, oh! This is not okay. This is fucked up in so many ways. Mr. Archer, I've seen you dragging things into your room. Mind the floors. I'll pay you for an. I'll make you pay for any scratches you leave. <sighs> the door won't budge. Okay, but have you seen this floor, man? It's not like there is anything to scratch. It's already scratched to the maximum. Do we go up? I'm quite curious. We do need to explore the location we are staying in, you know? Maybe there's something interesting, like more notes. We need to get to know the surroundings better. We need to, to figure out what's going on. No one? Okay. Sorry for the intrusion. I'm just here to... Take a peek at your private stuff. Maybe steal a couple of uh, gunpowder and alcohol. Since uh, I don't think you will be needing it. This is so filthy, guys. It's hor horrific. Too many coincidences. So, the lighthouse is out. Several ships have gotten lost at sea. And some are now decorating the city beaches. That's one thing. But now there's an enterprising fellow at the city port hiring salvagers to recover ships. Is turning a tidy profit for selling them. Can't be a coincidence. Can't be a coincidence. Need to look into it. Now, if only the city wasn't so impossible to navigate. Uh huh. Let's take a picture, shall we? Does that even do anything? He has a couple of marks at all the corners of the city. And this one mark at the middle is kind of loose. I don't know what he was doing. But that seems that everybody in the city is trying to figure out what's going on with them. Everybody's trying to do their own detective work, more or less. Hello? That is messed up. Everything is messed up here. Straight roof. Anything of interest here except for... Wow, everybody just lives like a bum here. That's, that's insane. Oh, so, okay. Scouting done. Navigating done. Reconnaissance done. Let's keep moving. Finally, you're awake. Gotta tell you, though, mister. You wanna stay on here? You stop making all that noise. What noise? Noise? What, what noise are you talking about? I expect my guests to be respectable. Moans, chanting, all that kind of thing. It stops, all right? Oh. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. I don't really remember what happened, but I'll, I'll do my best. Yeah, well, next time it happens, you end up sleeping under the bridge like the other newcomers. You're not exactly friendly with your guests. Aren't we the ones keeping you in business? All these newcomers after the flood, they're stark raven mad. What do you mean? You can't imagine the crazy notes and books I find after they move out. Only thing they're good for is lighting a kitchen stove. Can I have a look? I knew it. I tell you no one sane would be interested. And you want to take a look? You proposed well, it. fine, fine. Take what you wish. Oh, but I have already. I'm watching you, newcomer. Scouted so many stuff. Oh my god, we, we gotta take a seat. We gotta take a seat. Another note. Oh, damn. Jesus, note about the hobo signs. Darren, I think I'm finally starting to figure this out. 
Locals use signs to mark special places that you know already. Kinda like the secret sign hobos use all over the country. What I learned is that the tradition dates back to times well before the flood. I've been able to find out the meaning of some of them. You've seen the crooked H-shaped sign on the door around town, yes. That means that the house is inhabited. Ah, okay. The cross hatch grind sign marks hidden caches and useful items. The V-shaped sign is, barric is for barricaded dangerous places. Good catch here, they say. Okay, okay. Still haven't figured out the spiral shaped sign though you'll have to investigate for yourself that's probably some cultist and if you see a sign with a cross and the three k's reach for the gun okay okay we're gonna sit down in our notebooks letters from oakmont forlorn woman the city no matter how badly the flood damaged it was an unnatural appeal I can't stop myself from walking, even if it means being stuck by further visions. I went to the eastern part of the Salvation Harbor, near the crossing of Fitz O. Callahan Street and Old Church Road. It came. The feeling of loneliness and fear was immense. I was a woman, locked in a room, infected and slowly rotting. My body turned into something. It itched badly and my face... I hold... I had to hold the skin with both hands to prevent it from growing until I suffocated. I ended up sitting on the road, crying, until some inn's mother kicked me and ordered me away. Wow. Weird. Lone child, the visions are testing me, playing with my mind. My old forgotten fear came to come to life. My old forgotten fears come to life. When I was small, I was afraid to stay alone. I thought my parents would leave and never come back. Today I went to the eastern streets of Coverside and the visions came on the corner of St. Elmon Lane and Kingsport Street. I felt I was alone, forgotten in a locked room, hungry and frightened. It was so scary to stay inside, but everything was much worse behind the door. Something scratched in the corridor and there were terrifying screams from outside. I could not run, I could not hide, I just waited for mom to return. Mirrors, mirrors. I'm afraid something stalks me. It started when I visited Western Advent and had a vision at the intersection of Purity Road and Oak Street. I saw mirrors full of reflections and someone trapped, trying in vain to escape. His expression of fear and panic shook me deeply. After that, a very tall and skinny man started following me in the, in the distance. What troubles me is that I see him in the reflections. But I've never caught a straight view of the stalker. I'm sure the police will mock me if I come asking for protection. Seems it is time to buy a good trustworthy gun and start practicing. So from these first three notes I've already noticed that um, they have constantly been talking about intersection between streets. Disgusting exaltation. No matter how different my visions may be, they are always so frightening. Today it was... It was... Today it was man. He left the house in Southern Old Grove on Warwick Street. Somewhere between Seaside and Hillside Street. Hillside? Oak Street, Purity Street, Elmon Lane, Kingsport Street, Coverside, Old Church Road. Hmm, quite different. A rice met and I immediately felt a burning exaltation. A wild torrent of emotions. I saw him among the monstrosities, touching them, embracing, kissing. The vision was so intense, I bent in two and threw up all my breakfast. He walked past, saying something like, Curse newcomers. And I prayed he wouldn't stop to help. Even now, when I close my eyes, I see the creatures around this man. Call of the ocean. Tonight the air forced me to leave the hotel. The purid smell of rotting seaweed and fish made it hard to breathe. I remembered a huge apple tree and brought it and thought it may be nicer there. Moreover, I was afraid the hotel owner could see my seizures. The visions occurred when I was few blocks from the apple tree, walking E. Brown Street and Central Shells. 
it felt like I was drowning. I ran forward, and when I passed the street of St. Michael's Church, I felt the water surrounding me, pressing, calling. I needed all my will to fight the desire, the desire to go to the mare and sink into the depths. Okay. Static in ears. I was walking the Lombard Street in Eastern Rain Height when, I, when it happened again. It's not just a vision, but a noise. Hissing radio static, growing louder and louder. Voices from afar were lost in it, crying desperately. I tried not to show how bad it was. I was afraid to reveal it to the locals. The images came after I passed Bullock Street towards he Helock Street. The hissing flew in my mind, and I saw a man surrounded by radios talking to them. He was dying. I felt it. And when it happened, the vision was gone. <clears throat> Voices from the pipes. I'm afraid of the bathroom and the kitchen sink. Each time I want to wash my hands, I tremble in fear. What if they talk to me? This began after a vision in Western Reed Heights and the crossing of Abern Ward and Baker Street. I saw a man, naked and covered in blood, in a room without doors and windows, surrounded by the dark holes of the pipes. He was cutting himself, piece by piece, feeding those copper mouths. There were whispers with voices, so sweet and promising, but full of hunger and hatred. How could he believe them? Could he even escape? And had they noticed me? From behind. I can't help but to turn around at any noise after what I saw yesterday. I walk down the Murdoch Avenue in Western Advent and near Oak Street I was hit by an excruciating migraine. My nose started to bleed and the visions came. I saw one man writing a letter and another one about to strike him from behind. Somehow I was both a spectator and a sitting man, but no matter how I cried out warnings or tried to move it didn't work. It seems I lost consciousness when the killer hit the man's head, and it took me several hours to get back to the hotel after. Terrible fetus. After this vision, I shake in fear the sound of a child's cry. It happened in Western Reed Heights, on Washington Street. I passed Avon Street and was heading towards Oak Street, but saw it. The thing was running so fast, I didn't even understand what it was. It jumped from the window and the vision struck me immediately. I saw a man, a doctor, hiding in the room. He was writing something with a shaking hand, something like lost will. And then I saw the thing stalking him, a fetus on thin, pointy legs, with a little face full of evil and hatred. It shrieks, I can't forget it. In Smouter Notes A local the local Innsmouthers scare me a lot. I've never seen a place with so many ill people. Their face pursue me even in visions. Recently I was in the northern part of Grimhaven Bay, walking down Whisper Street. I barely made it to Herbert Avenue when the visions came. I stood among many Innsmouthers disguised as one of them and listened. Their leader read a story of a captain participating in pagan rites, copulating with savage witches and beasts, bringing sacrifices. I still remember his name, Obed. Lullaby Crossroads Today I fell asleep on the street. I'm sure it is connected to my vision somehow, because I felt the same nausea and headache as before the strike. It happened in Crook, it happened in Coverside, near the corner of Tanner Street and Old Church Road. I felt dizzy in my mouth, was full of bittersweet taste. I saw a woman with kind eyes giving me a drink and whispering something. Immediately after I fell asleep and spent nearly half a day living in the dark like a hobo. It's a miracle no one stole anything from me. Back of notes, the hotel owner allowed me to look through the weird notes he found in the rooms of disappeared newcomers. So it are disappeared newcomers. I thought he said they just left. Among them I found several pages from the diary of a man describing his life in Oakmont. He suffered from visions and marked the places where they happened. He was trying to avoid them. Lore. Documents. 
So the lighthouse is out. That we have seen. Keep it down. We have seen nightmares. We have seen now. Have the marks been placed? The marks have not been placed, guys. So I'll probably have to... Lincoln Street, Old Church Road. I probably am going to spend some time off screen trying to... Uh, mark the maps and navigate maybe something like that yes okay that was a lot of reading guys but we are up to the story now it's an interesting piece of um to walter okay help you if you hear your peddling your cheap affordable living again i could live with your renting out beasts ridden flop houses but you're cutting into my profit don't make that mistake. I know you're from the fish market. And I have dangerous people living here that I can send after you. You are warned, Vic. Oh my Christ. Everything and everybody has some sort of issue or problem or argument with somebody here. Well, sir. I'm watching you, newcomer. Thank you very much. Let's go outside. So, the letter H is its inhabitant. Good to know. Good to know. This place looks actually not that amazing. Is this my boat? Yeah, there's my little boat that I have to travel around. That's cool. That's cool. Okay. We need to be going. To Walter. No. Uh, casebook. My main case. Completed cases. Side cases. Those are all letters. What? No. Uh, how do we do it again? Facebook? Aha! Uh -huh. I need to place it myself! Eastern Salvage and Harbor crossing with Fitz. I get it now. That's how it works. Lincoln Street is here. Where is Lincoln Street? Do we have that? Old Church. Old Church is somewhere here. Eastern Salvation Harbor. Okay. Crossing Fitz O'Callan Street. Fitz O'Callan Street. Fitz O'Callan Street. Okay, I'll do that later. Now is not the time. Now is not the time. Let's go to our main case. Um, where do we go first? An expedition. Yes. Um, Robert Throckmorton gave me a key to the expedition headquarters. It is in a northern cover site at the crossroads of Ashen Road and Herbert Avenue. Northern cover site. Pin evidence. Northern cover site. Northern. Northern cover site. Um, Asher Road and Herbert Avenue. Asher Road. Asher Road is this one. Asher Road. And Hubert Avenue. Is it this one? There's a police station. Are located in the northern cover site. Crossroad of Asher Road and Hubert Avenue. Asher Road and Hubert Avenue. Probably here. You know? Probably here. So that's where we're gonna go. Mark compass. I don't think we need that. That's over there. Can we go there by... No. We must take the boat. We must take the boat. Uh, where is the boat? Here's the boat. Nice. That is actually freaking cool. 
Can I not dock here? Hello, guys, can you help me? Can you help me? No, no one is willing. Well, thank you all. This is not going how I want it to be going. Ah, get out of this mess. Ah, I see, I see. I can only dock this way. I get it, I get it. Then we must be... I mean, how is... We are completely stuck here. Oh my god, another note. What is this? Ah, it's a fast travel point. That's good to know. Anything of interest here? I mean, this place was beautiful, I guess, but now it's a complete mess. Complete, complete mess. We've got another boat, which is good, but I think I can run this. Okay. This looks so good, guys. This looks so good. Let me take a picture of this. Quite epic. Now, let's make way towards the headquarters of the investigation. What is this? Those are gross rats. Ew. Oh, those are cats. Ugh, sorry I killed a the cat. They just looked so horrifying. Oh my, this thing looks beautiful. Here is clothes for men and women. Closed. Good to know. Oh, are we going to scavenge uh, into piles now? Into garbage? Okay. Okay, good for me. Yes, everything is very super ominous. Very super weird. West Mend. A police officer, hello. No? A news crier. Anything to cry about? No. Wow. Oh my god. No photograph, do you hear me? Are you okay? Look for your sins. Hello, police? Why does nobody want to be photographed? I'm a journalist. Suits and top coats. Oh yeah, I'm interested. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Damn. So many cool. Oh, it's a little bit further. So many. Oh, hello, lady. Are you enjoying yourself? Yeah, I'm gonna leave you to it. You need to let loose. Well, what do you have to offer? Picture. Wasn't fast enough. Uh, you look suspicious. You, 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 your leg hurt, man. Okay. Everybody is just. I don't know. Everybody just looks like. Like the end of the world. What the hell? What the hell? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Police! Why are you neglecting your things? This guy is just dead here. Jesus. This is so not okay. What is this? What are you doing? Oh, that's to take a piss. I took a picture of you. I've got evidence now. Whatever you gonna do, I got evidence. So many weird freaking cultists here. Come here, boots and shoes. No. No boots and shoes for me. Where are we now about? Okay, probably this huge station is the police station. Oh my, it is heavily fortified. It even has harpoons. What are they expecting? Hello? Mr. Farmer? So it seems not everyone wants to talk to me, and I don't think that there are so many interesting places to scavenge, look around. Well, those should... I 
don't like these noises. Are there more? Potion! Oh my god! There are more! Jesus, those noises are freaking scaring me out! Freaking me out! Hello? Anyone? Hello? I'm private detective. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Oh no 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 no. Fuck you. Oh, my goodness. What the? What the? Fuck? What was that? Oh my Christ! What in the name of God was that? Oh shoot! Whew. Silent now? Oh. What in the hell? Did I escape? Oh, Christ. No, don't seem like I did. So, um. It's still somewhere here. Okay, it is not gone. Can we craft a couple of bullets more? Can I do that? Can I craft bullets? Craft. Oh. My. God. That was practically nothing. Okay, but we got five. Nothing. Gonna go up through this side. Do they hear us? Oh, guys, I'm tense. What is what kind of monstrosity is the thing? Where is it? One. What is that? Oh, I'm going to die here. Where's the med kit? No, wrong buttons. Gotta run out. What the hell is this? What the hell is this? Use it! What did I take? Oh, that was the wrong one. Holy God! What am I supposed to do? How do you kill those things?
Okay, I think if we stay silently, we can quickly scavenge around. Don't know, see what there is to see. Let's quickly go back down. See if we missed anything. I think as long as we stay silent, we'll be okay. Anything my visions help me. No, visions don't help anything. Any more special casings? Any special loot? Oh my god, those things came back to life. And they, as soon as we run outside, everybody just said he's going mad, he's going mad. Which means I'm the only one seeing this? Or what? Because I've just blasted all my bullets through. Like, everything is out. Inventory. Let's at least craft three, you know? Be very, very silently now about this. There is one. Got a trap. One straight above me, I'm pretty sure. There are two of them. Damn it, guys, we need to get up somehow. Cool. We'll read it later. Running! Running! Flashlight up! Where are we going to? Here's something, pick it up! Run! Run! Oh, there's nothing to run to! What the hell is this? Oh my god! Ooh. Give me this! Give me this! No! 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 That wasn't what I wanted to do! No! What the hell? Did I just step in my own trap? What an idiot. What an idiot. What an idiot. What an... Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Oh my Jesus Christ. What did I do that? What was the whole point of that doing? What was the whole point of that doing? Did we learn anything? We learned something. There is no point running away. That blasted hollow-eyed freak always catches up with his grin. His long black coat and those thin crooked fingers clutching a gun. He's got a bullet with his name on it. Dodged it once. But there uh, won't be a second time. Okay, help me. Oh god. Oh god. That was something, wasn't it guys? Uh, that's some beautiful art you got there. And we lost the trap because I'm an idiot. I stepped inside it myself. Can we recraft it? Oh, we can. There we go. Medkit. Craft it. Heal myself up. Uh, by the way, no, let's not heal up. Let's first see if we cannot um, heal by going to sleep or something. But, where must we be going? An expedition headquarters are located northern cover side. This is cover side. This is north. Crossroads of Asher Road, that's this, and Hubert Avenue, that's this, must be here, one of these buildings, don't tell me it was, 
Maybe it's this one. Hello? No. What in the name of God, guys? Why is it so difficult to find? Excuse me. I'm looking for headquarters. Oh, you look fancy schmancy, man. You look fancy schmancy fancy. Don't tell me it is this building. It cannot be true. There's no indication this is the study headquarters. Um, damn. Where am I running to? It is this block. Located in the northern side. Crossroad of Asher Road. That's this one. And Hubert Avenue. I'm at Hubert Avenue. So crossroad. So it's one of these buildings. Straight in front of me. Okay. Let's test. Oh, here's an H. Yes. We got it. Ooh, nice. They've got scuba diving materials and equipment. That's super cool. That's super cool. What have they found here? Fishman, scuba diving, ancient artifacts, and... Oh. Guess I don't need the key. We're gonna go ducking. Something is strange here. Let's take the gun. We've only got a little bit left. Dangers of diving. Diving with a bent can suffer from numerous symptoms, including pain, impaired movement, nausea, vomiting, and disorientation. Acute symptoms can occur within 10 minutes of suffocating, and included paralysis, numbness, blindness, deafness, dizziness, seizures, confusions, or a word coming out of weird. The paralysis and numbers can involve several different parts of the body at the same time. Well, it's a lucky thing I don't need to go diving to mumble jumble all my words. I just do it by natural. Okay. Are a few damp papers all that's left of the expedition? Uh -huh. Okay, I understand I need to go there. That's okay by me, but give me... Someone smashed it beyond repair. Yep, seems like it. Seems like it. A map. Interesting. Some nice... Um, typers or so typing machines a bookcase with supplies we definitely can use it as I'm being an idiot and I've blasted all my supplies already through so birdies oh. you've got to be kidding me that I just went through a wall That's insane, I went through a wall. Archly burnt cargo manifest. The following must be delivered. Grimhaven Bay, no later than Friday. MKV diving suits, air tanks, canned food, personal belongings, six crates with names probably. Research equipment, seven crates, air pipes, phone stations and wires, power generators responsible for... What the f So, yeah, where is the med kit? Pump it right in. Yep, gonna need it. We're gonna need it. Okay, that was extraordinary. That was extraordinary indeed. Some. No what the f. Hey! Stop! Stop! Stop right there! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it. 
Oh, did I kill him? Maybe violence is not the solution, guys. And maybe I shouldn't have killed him. The H. Doak Anthropologist, the Oakmont University Department of Anthropology, welcomes the newest addition to its rank, Professor Harriet Doak. Her brilliant discoveries about the origin of Intuit tribes have added a new page of history book for humanity. Now, Professor Doak will embark on a new expedition to hopefully shed light on the source of the flood and in doing so shed light on what may yet to become okay um this is peculiar These samples glitter in a weird way i wonder where they came from Fisherman report. L. Sullivan and B. Morgan. Local fisherman report numerous large bubbles and an unbearable stench rising from the bottom of the sea. But a sample of weird substances floating in the ocean from J. Harvey. He claimed he found it among numerous dead and strangely deformed fish. The fish were taken for analysis. Several locals mentioned a rock that rose from the seabed, making the fog shine in different colors. The witnesses felt sick and dizzy for two or three days after the incident. LP Stern got severe burns after chiseling of part of the rock in the basement. Sample snake for analysis. I freaking killed the fisherman. That was completely not what I wanted to do. I wanted to knock him out, but I didn't think that a shovel would uh, instantly kill him after a couple of hits. Damn, stupid. Oh, those are the eels that attacked us underwater. Crazy. Yeah, dangerous, dangerous, dangerous. Can't say I ever saw another shell like it. Wow, guys, so much weird stuff going on. So much weird stuff. But damn, why did I kill him? That's not what I wanted to do. Let me first go back down. Where's my gun? Why did he run? What did he run? What did he... What? Why? Why, man? Shop. He probably just wanted to run to some place, but he had a gun in his hand. And I didn't want to shoot. I, ex I ex on purposely did not shoot because I didn't want to kill him. Uh, guess this helmet's beyond repair. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is done then. Damn it. Okay, let's go start investigating here. So, here is something. I fatah me a fe a regach I Dagon. Dagon. Heard that before. Grab the papers. Smash the rest. That seems to be like fishmen. Yeah, in smouders. And some others. Okay. We don't have time to pick it. Stand back. Okay, three in others for whatever reason. Uh huh. Burn it all. Make sure you get the adverts. Time to figure this out. Time to figure this out. So, people hit I these guys. I no, Dagon. that's three. Probably three. I that's one. They came inside the rubbish trophy. They took everything. The they knew, the found, and created maybe a fake wall. I and then they burned everything. I Burn it all. Make sure you get the adverts. Several men broke into the expedition headquarters. What they didn't smash, they burned. The archives, even the newspapers. Okay. Again, that horrible dead creature. Wow. That's a partially burnt cargo. That's a delicious. Uh, Pillaged, pillaged headquarters. Uh, some lore. 
Danger of diving here for a three. So mindless. Cargo manifest. The cargo from the expedition was taken to the Grim Haven Bay. The expedition headquarters was vandalized by insmothers. They burned all the expedition archive, even the newspapers. The expedition is lo archive is lost, but I still have clues to follow upon. They left the city on a freighter from Grimhaven Bay. There might be recent postings or ads about freighter in the Oakmont Chronicles. Okay. Okay, his book. Nope, wanted to pin it. So, Oakmont Chronicles. Apparently that's where we gotta go. And, yep, I still have about a thousand questions to why there are those fishman creatures outside in that building over there. Very many questions I have. Very many questions I have. Oakmont Chronicles, is that where we're going? Place marker. No. Compass marker, there we go. Up to the newspaper, see what's up there. Um, got a fisherman which I couldn't interrogate for questions, which is bad as well. I'm sorry. Dashing through. What happened to all these cars? Was there like a real flood, 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 flood? Probably were, yeah. Hello, sir. What the f What? Are you not- That's not okay! He's carrying a body in a backpack! Holy Christ! What is the police even doing here? That's everything but okay! Hey, knock it off! Jesus! Okay, I guess. Okay, I guess. Oakmont Chronicles, be ready. Hello, sir. Hello, lady. Well. Good day. The old papers are by the door. Take them and stop bothering me already. I think wow. you've got me confused with someone else. Aren't you a newcomer? Help me out here. What's the connection between newcomers and old. and old newspapers? It's cold sleeping in the street, and they come to collect the old newspapers for warmth. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I guess I am a newcomer. Charles Reed, private investigator. And I also need your old newspapers, uh, the archive, to be exact. Ah, so so you're the one who cracked the Albert Throgmorton murder well, case. Well, since my name goes nice spy so fast. I'm Helen Bland. Say, can you do me a favor? What? Give me an exclusive interview. You won't regret it. The Oakmont Chronicle is the best newspaper for miles around. All right, I'll uh, be sure to make some time for you, Miss Bland. Um, are we going to do it? No. See you later. No. I'm not here for interviews or whatever she wants. But I need the archive. Press D for archive information. Archives. You will often need to look for useful information within various city archives. Archives contain top topical information, for example, city hall, holds general data about citizens and organizations, while info about specific organizations or people like criminal parents can be found in police stations. In the casebook, evidence may have hint icons indicating you need to do some archive research. In the archive interface, select the pieces of evidence you wish to investigate and choose the three criteria. Okay. Okay. Newspaper archive. Let me first quickly run around. Uh, pardon me for the intrusion. Have anything interesting? Nope. Nope. I'm gonna quickly have a look upstairs. Anything of value here? Why is nobody working? Who is writing the newspapers? Miss Bland, are you doing anything, everything by your own, by yourself? It's only you. Oh, cartridges for shotgun revolvers. 
Hello, this is the probably the office of the boss. Is there anything I can just quickly borrow? You know, you're just a little bit of lookings. Uh huh. We got a gang member at the top, and here as well, and there as well, probably. Got a Poch tribe living there. The monkey people there. Uh, don't know what. Cultists there. And these two kissing. Oh no, it's a, it's a sh shoulder kiss. It's a cheek kiss. It's like a greeting. I do not know if all the information that we see here must be read. But better safe than sorry. <sighs> I think so that the flood... They're talking about a flood, but I think there was like a tsunami flood. But every, Because everything seems destroyed and, and wet. Oh yeah, nice. Okay. Enough running around. Enough collecting evidence. Let's go and... Um, advise the archives so people's people section direction hmm. ad choose evidence bird newspapers that's what we're going about the expedition lost but i still have clues to follow up there might be recent postings on ads about a freighter in oakmont chronicle district Grimhaven Bay. This one. Section. City. We need to find some postings or ads. Ads. Period. Is that expedition lost, but it's still expeditions after the flood? Search. Ship freighter advertisement. A 30 ton ship, uh, Titania, is currently available for hire. You will find it fully equipped for transport as well as the aiding of underwater ventures and exploration for the price of 70 rifle bullets or the equivalent of their port per week. 70 per week. Those interested in urged are urged to contact Captain Jeremiah Sanders for contact contracting details. It can be found at Pier 3, Oakmont Port. Good. That's actually quite awesome, guys. Village headquarters. Cargo manifest. Can we... Can we remove something, maybe? So, after the flood. Current events. Articles and interviews, front page, current events. Mm, I don't think... No, I don't think we can get any information about the cargo manifest. But what we can get is... So... Oakmont Port, Grimhaven Bay. Oakmont Port? Is that this one? Yeah, Grimhaven Bay, Oakmont Port, Pier 3. That's probably where we docked. Place the marker. So we need to be about there, I assume. That's understood. Anything here? Nothing. Do you have to get skill points, by the way? Still not. No, lady, I changed my mind. Let's give you some interview. Why not? Why not? Do you still want that interview? I, uh, I got some time now, if we you're can, ready. We can make a name. Maybe oh, we can earn absolutely. some little cash. We know that you're the private eye who solved the case. Correct. But tell our reader something more about yourself. Oh... I'm gonna, uh, we're not going to go military side, we're just gonna investigate it from Boston. I'm a private eye in Boston. The situation in the port was a good use of my skills. Well, uh, Detective Reed, I, I think you'll find our city has a lot of secrets. I noticed. Uh, but people may not like you poking your nose in. That's a shame. Uh, maybe we'll have the chance to work together later. <laughs> Who knows? And now the big question. Why are you here? What brought you to Oakmont? Tracking down missing people. Let's lie a little bit, you know? I've been investigating disappearances all around Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. 
The missing people all seem to have ended up here for some reason. Hmm. The mystery of That's the newcomers. That's something I did not do. And you want to know why they're here? Yes. Well, they aren't very forthcoming about it. No. And it doesn't help that most of them aren't thinking straight, mm -hmm. to put it mildly. I think that's enough for now. I can't give the readers too much all at once. Thank you for your interview, so, Mr. Reed. My pleasure. And maybe I'll do something interesting enough to make the papers again. You never know. Bye. See you later. Okay, let's see how that turns out. Uh, hold this. Village headquarters, burn newspapers, shift for advertisement. That's where we need to go. Okay, it was actually not that bad. It was actually not that bad at all. Is that a human again? No, that's just a pile of trash. We have been about... Now... Can we quickly run there? No, I don't think we can run there. Ooh, no, I don't think. We need to go over here, then here with the boat, and down, then here. No, I think we will uh, leave it for later. Uh, gotta take a boat. Can we go from here, there? Yeah, I wanna go back to the port before I finish this episode. So let's go to the small boat here we have. That's following straight to the left. Oh my god, you look so horrible. You need to eat something. Oh, chill everyone. Take it easy. Why does everybody come here? You no, know, like distinguished gentlemen like him. Running cultists around and everybody has like, yeah, this is a place where I want to live. This seems amazing. Yeah And what's with the barnacles and what the... How do we get there? Uh, being a detective is so difficult I must admit We're gonna go to the left and left again That's actually nice a stroll throughout Oakmont, the sinking city. Yeah. Oh, there's another one. Uh, is it left here already? No, not here. That's a whale. Just a dead, rotting fish. I mean, the smell here must be awful, I guess. Like, really awful. Hey, okay, guys, you gotta move. Passing through. I'm important, you know? Another whale. God damn it. It seems like... I don't know, if it only has been a couple of months, but can such... infestation of sea life grow in a couple of months only? Seems to be unrealistic. The die just went completely wrong. What an idiot. You still go here left. Gotta be fast, though. Oh, that's handy. Handy dandy. No, not again. Turned the route wrong. Other side. Why is navigating so difficult in water? I need a GPS. There's my GPS. There's my GPS. Oh, 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 a chair. He has having uh, nightmares and hysteria. Illusions. Now we're going more or less correct. I assume this place was beautiful someday. In the past. Can we dock here? Again. Beautiful. Yes. Let's run back toward the headquarters. Uh, guys, no fighting, please. No fighting. <laughs> chill out, okay? Chill out. Are you... Is, uh, uh, that does not look edible, man. That does not look edible at all. Uh, uh, might. What do, what do we even eat here? Am I going to eat squid all day? Get the truck out of here. Oh, 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 relax, man. Relax, yo. Hey, yo. You too, relax, man. <gasps> what a mutations. Do you see that, guys? Those are not rats. 
that something that's inside the cat that's disgusting and disturbing that's something that crawls that's the freaking mouth of the cat oh that's gross something that crawls inside the animals Ugh. Uh, gross and disgusting. Hello all. What's your problem? My problem is that I am the VIP hey, of this place, man. We're going to solve all your crimes and all your problems. You better be friendly. You better pay me some bullets. Just caught, mister. That looks... Yeah, enjoy. Uh, yeah, yeah. You can enjoy all the fish you want, man. I want to kill all those infestations. They seem to be dangerous to be left alive. They just seem to be too dangerous to be left alive. Those poor kitty kittens. Where did I come to? Oh no, the entrance was that way. Wow. I need to start recognizing this area here a little bit because I don't. Fish, fish. Just I completely call, don't. Where is the entrance? There's some huge ass wall here. Ah, here, here, here. To the right. Why is my marker still there? Is there no easier way to remove the marker? There we go. Remove the marker. Now we can go back inside. Okay, back at the docks. Let's quickly see how um, how this is going here. Door won't budge. Okay, are you only open at evening hours. I assume you are, since it's broad daylight now. We do have a little bit of sun, which is nice. Which is nice. Oh, we've got a little bit more vision now. A pier. What? What? Thank K. At last. Hey, hey, help. Help. What's going on? Sea creatures swarmed over the piers. I hid here. But these walls won't stand up to them. Please help me. What? What creatures? What are you talking about? Wild beasts. Yeah. They came to feast on the blood. They eaten the dead. Yeah. Okay, but I'm looking for some sort of I'm Sanders. I'm looking for Captain Sanders. Is he here in the port? Did the creatures get him? Uh, I saw Sanders. Help me. I I'll tell you what I know. Okay, so we're gonna go creature hunting, guys. But we'll leave that for the next episode, guys. Thank you very much for watching. This was an episode with a lot of information to our brains. I'm, I need to process it as well. Maybe I need to place some markers by the next episode so that we can have a little bit of overview to where about at the intersections are these visions coming from that guys we'll see you in the next episode thank you so very much for watching guys don't forget to leave a like subscribe drop a comment down below share your thoughts with me and i will see you in the next episode have a good day everyone